Hey guys, I am Black Ops, and today for you, I've got some awesome news I want to share with you about Black Ops 3 Zombies. So I'm pretty sure a lot of you, if not all of you, are going to be really excited for this. But Treyarch's Jason Blundell has confirmed on Black Ops 3 Fridays that the original core Black Ops Zombies story will continue and expand within the Call of Duty Black Ops 3 DLC season. So the first DLC we get for Call of Duty Black Ops 3 will be carrying on from the original Black Ops Zombies storyline. We will no longer, you know, we won't be carrying on from Shadows of Evil. That will just be a one-off. The DLC 1, 2, 3, and 4 will be carrying on from the original Black Ops Zombies storyline. Now, if we go back to the, you know, original Black Ops storyline, it ended on the moon where our four characters, uh, you know, blew up the earth, the original characters, and we never heard anything from them again. In Black Ops 2, we went on to use the Origins characters, and we also went on to use our new crew, which was Misty Martin, um, Samuel, and uh, I forgot the other one. I can't quite remember. But for the DLC in Black Ops 3, we'll be continuing from Moon with the Black Ops Zombie storyline. So, what's going to be happening? Are we still going to be going, you know, on, are we going to be playing on the map Moon for the first DLC? That could be very interesting. What do you think about this down in the comment section below? Will our characters be traveling all the way back to our destroyed Earth? I have absolutely no idea. <laughs> it really is amazing. There's so many possibilities where they can actually carry on from the Black Ops storyline. Um, you know, it, it's awesome. It's awesome. I'm glad we are not carrying on with Shadows of Evil. Kind of a disappointment. Maybe we aren't carrying on with, you know, from the Giant. Uh, but yeah, anyway, so that's the first bit of information I want to share with you. He also confirmed that the Giants, which is a remake of Darius, the map has new Easter eggs, a new narrative system, and the Shadows of Evil Gobble Gum system. So we've already seen that in with in the Giant, the Gobble Gum Perk Machine. You can see it up on screen now. He says there's going to be a new narrative system. Now, what does this mean? Someone explained it quite well that maybe the characters will actually be, you know, narrating the story, telling you what to do. The dialogue will actually fit in a lot better than it did. In previous zombies games so that could be very interesting and also brand new easter eggs which is what you would expect as long as you know there's probably well there is going to be a new storyline to this map a bigger and better storyline so again some more of awesome information there and finally he confirmed that shadows of evil has more easter eggs than in any other call of duty zombies map to date and also there are more easter eggs in the trailers for shadows of evil that we haven't found yet so again awesome and uh, just interesting information not really Probably not going to be my favourite map. The giant looks amazing. I can't wait till we get the DLC so we can carry on with the Black Ops Zombie storyline. This video has had to be, you know, a little bit fast for me because I'm going out. I wanted to get a video done for you guys today. So it should be up later. Uh, probably, I don't know, around about 11 in the UK. But hopefully you've enjoyed. Let me know what you think about this down in the comment section below. For me, this is really awesome information. Uh, just a bunch of it all together. I thought I'd include it in this one video. Drop a like rating if you want to share the video around. Let's just go for three likes on the video. I think we can do that. If you want to see some more from me, make Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Thank you all very much for watching. I've been Black Ops Amazing, and until next time, peace out.